Welcome to the video. We will install nmap. The command is pkj space install space nmap. Enter and Y to continue. Type nmap and enter to check all the available options that we can run with nmap. Scanning any website is illegal without permission, but we can scan this scanme.nmap.org. So we can type the command nmap and the website name and enter. This is a test website for scanning using nmap and we could find the open ports services and their state. We can type different commands along with nmap to change its functionality according to our requirement. Now we will type nmap space minus small v and the website name to give us the verbose output that is what is happening behind the scene. Finally we can see the result. Now we will type pkj space update to update all the package index list of termux. Type y and press enter. Now we will type the command pkj space upgrade to upgrade all the packages installed in Termux to the latest version. We type clear to clear the screen and make it tidy. Now we will type the command pkj space install space curl space wget space git space open ssl space hyphen y and install these packages and after that clear the screen. Now paste this command. I will give all the commands in the description. You can just copy and paste. Now I am giving the execute permission to this uh, metasploit.sh script by chmode space plus x space metasploit.sh. We will type dot forward slash metasploit.sh to run the setup. It's a long process, so be patient. I have first forwarded this video to 2x speed, so be prepared. In reality, it will take even longer time. So just be patient and wait until everything is finished. This will automatically install all the required packages and dependencies. So it will take some time. When you see green color, this is about to finish now. Uh, Metasploit is now installed successfully. We will check the service if it is running. We will paste this command. Post theory SQL is already started, I think, because if you check the status, so we can see that post theory SQL is already running. Let's clear the screen now. Now we will type MSF console to run Metasploit framework here in this Termux. We can change banners by typing BANNER banner. You can see each and every time I type banner, the banner changes. This is just for fun, nothing serious. Now let me check if Metasploit is installed correctly. I will just run this command use space exploit forward slash multi forward slash handler. And by default it took this payload, but we can type show options and check all the required options that need to be filled. So here we need to fill L host. We can also set our payload by typing specifying set space payload space windows forward slash meter printer forward slash reverse underscore tcp now we can type the command options to check the required option that need to be set before running this now we can type back and clear the screen and check different exploits these are different metasploit modules auxiliary scanners exploit payload etc now let's search for eternal blue exploit and see all the modules available. So this is eternal blue exploit. Mm -hmm. 
now we'll check if msf venom is installed correctly yeah it is installed these are the required option we can create payload using msf venom and multi handler to listen to the connection using reverse tcp so we'll type we'll create a payload using the command msf venom space minus p for payload space windows meter printer forward slash reverse underscore tcp so this is the command to create a payload so if you want to know more about you can contact me i will do an online session to teach you about metasploit framework how you can run metasploit in termux or even kali linux Earlier I tried to install Metasploit framework but I was unsuccessful but now I successfully installed this and in my upcoming videos I will discuss more about Metasploit and hacking. So far so good. It's installed properly. So thanks for watching.